Alright guys, we're gonna talk about a new hormone that is gonna make people live longer. Or so they think. Is that really a good thing? I mean, we have like food problems enough as it is, like, yeah? Yo guys, what's going on? Dave Wobble here, and we are talking about living a little bit longer, here for you, on IO. Okay, so considering we're going to talk about life and living, I want to know, what do you guys really want to do for a living? Let me know down there in the comments below. So the anti-aging pill, it's something that everybody wants, everybody thinks is out there. Girls are always looking for that cream to make themselves look so much younger. But you know what guys, step aside because we're going to talk about Hormone FGF. 21. And this thing has been pretty successful at improving weight loss. If it's been proven, why don't I get shots of these things every single day? Oh yeah, baby. But the crazy thing is, they think now it may actually help people live twice as long. They've discovered that FGF21 is very important to the thymus glands, which the thymus glands weaken and they get fatty later on in age and they stop working. And the thymus glands, they're important because they produce T cells, the white blood cells, which help us fight off diseases. And obviously when they get older, like I said, they get fatty and they don't work just amazing. That's why when people get old, they are more susceptible to diseases and you know other viruses. Couldn't figure out the word viruses, that's why I stuttered on it. Yeah. Now this was discovered by Professor Vishwa Dixit and the rest of the team at the Yale School of Medicine. Now with the tests that they've done, they say, yeah, there's a good chance it'll delay aging problems. I'm kind of wondering if it'll work on the mind because you know, you might be like, you know, 200 years old. When you reach 100, will your mind be like you were 30 or will it be like a 100 year old guy and you won't remember jack sh But either way, I want to know from everybody out there, would you kill it and want to live longer or are you totally fine with living to like 70, 80 or 90 and saying screw it earth, I'm out of here. I feel like you get bored of a lot of things after living like 200 years. Oh yeah, and by the way, this hormone, they also think it can cure cancer. Cool. Thanks for watching guys, Dave Wobble here, this has been IO. If it's your first time hanging out here guys, hit that subscribe button and hang out a little bit more. Other than that, plenty of other videos for you guys to check out. See you guys in the next video, keep it real, keep it classy, keep it on the flip side. Out there, in the aging world.